Authorities are looking for a gator who they say killed a 47 year old man in Largo. They believe the man was looking for those frisbee golf discs when the attack happened. Residents say gator sightings happen pretty much daily around that lake. It happens so often, some of the locals call it Gator Lake. Despite several warning signs, neighbors say people still go out into the water to try and retrieve those discs. Not surprised at all. It's sad to say that. But, you know, Floridians believe that, you know, they're invincible. They go in the waters, they swim, and a gator's a gator. It's not your friend. Two years ago, another man who was looking for discs survived a gator attack in that exact same lake. And this deadly attack in Largo shares similarities to an attack that happened about four years ago at Barnett Park. Fox 35's Connor Hansen has a look at what you can do if you come face to face in the water with a gator. It might happen more than you think. Someone was attacked right here in Orlando, trying to get a disc out of the water while playing a round of disc golf here in Barnett Park. Experts say this is when you're most likely to encounter an alligator. Police in Largo believe a man was searching for disc golf discs when he was killed by an alligator. Here at Barnett Park, where an alligator attacked someone playing disc golf in 2018, we saw people trying to snag a stray disc. They tell us it's not uncommon. And you see people with scuba gear just swimming in the lakes. They do it on the other course over there too. And sometimes you get calls from people with your disc. They take extra caution though, especially after someone was attacked looking for a disc in this part. Always a risk and uh, it's unfortunate what happened to him. Back in 2018, that man who was bitten in the leg survived. Wildlife officials searched for what they believed was a mother gator protecting its nest. This time of the year is when you're most likely to run into one of these alligators. Experts here at Gatorland explain to us what you should do if you run into one. Most people can outrun a gator on land, but from the water, Brandon Fisher tells us you should try to scare them off. Ideally, the best thing is for you to make yourself bigger than what they are. Alligators uh, out in the wild, their main diet are turtles, fish, and birds. Mostly turtles, small things. Back in 2018, trappers searched for that alligator, but it was never found. In Orlando, Connor Hansen, Fox 35 News.